I got a hankering for some pork butt. And not just any pork butt, I want the best part. No more messing around, I want that money muscle, son. Welcome back to Everett Barbecue. I'm Joe Everett and today we're gonna have a $7 Money Muscle Sandwich. I don't know how many of you got an Aldi in your area or accessible to one, but they sell half pork butts. Basically what that is is the shoulder blades removed and the top half that's left has the money muscle for you. So today we're smoking one of those in the Dynaglow offset smoker, slicing it up and making barbecue sandwiches. Okie dokie, this is what is known as a CT butt or collar butt. Got this bad boy at Aldi's for $7.76. Be awesome if it was $7.77, but you know, it is what it is. This area, if you look between the netting, is the money muscle, and this is the top of your pork butt. The bottom half that's missing is where the shoulder blade would actually be. Gonna take this netting off and hopefully the bad boy doesn't fall apart when we do. And honest to goodness, we're not gonna do a ton of trimming here. I may get rid of this. It's usually a little bit of the uh, blood vessel in there. Come here, mister. You think you're slick. Don't come up and hide my pork button and me some questions. And this little edge of the cap, I'm not so interested in. Sriracha is back on the menu. This side first. Shouldn't need too much of this binder. It's been swimming in cryovac juices. Standard, the first thing we're gonna go with is a little bit of AP. You know you love your salt, pepper, garlic, but I put a little onion powder up in mine. Should have just enough of the sticky little piggies left. Mm -hmm. Ain't that looking nice? Repeat the process on the top side and... Let's get the smoker ready and make some $7 Money Muscle sandwiches. Since we're cooking a pork butt, it's pretty standard. There's four chunks of hickory, and to that, I'm gonna add a good store of cherry. Since we probably won't be adding to this fire, I wanna make sure we've got a good store of wood in there so we get consistent smoke on that little butt. That little half butt. Kingsford Pro is on sale, so we're using it. Okay, gang, here's our half butt. Don't you look pretty. Get this on old Dinah. Have us some money muscle sandwiches. All right. I got all the vents open. We're shooting for 275. I'm just gonna get some smoke on this little half butt and have us some money muscle sandwiches. Okay, it's been a little over an hour and a half. This is not a big piece of meat, so let's see how how are barks looking on this? Mm -hmm. I don't believe it's totally set yet. All right, we're gonna spritz this down. Just a real light spritz to start off. It's only been an hour and a half. The crust isn't super set, but I definitely don't want it drying out either. All right, we're pretty much two hours on the nose. Time for the second spritz. Just about set there and everywhere else is pretty nice and crusty. So we got a good bark going on her. This apple juice, uh, apple cider vinegar and water, one part each. In case you was curious, bright sunny day. I think it said it was at 144 internal temp here. Yeah, that, that crust is 
nice and set. Show you what we have going. Actually, she's kind of getting dry up on this end. Ooh, plenty hot. Dinah's going to get right back up to temp, and we're going to be having some money muscle sandos. Sidebar, at Costco right now, they got the biggest freaking bag of charcoal I've ever seen in my life. Had to get it. I don't even like this stuff, but good God, $20 for 34 pounds of charcoal? I'd be a fool not to. I mean, are you seeing this? Well, gang, we've been at it for about three and a half hours. I think we're at 154, 155-ish. Don't hold me to anything. Oh man, I like the way this looks. Bark's nice and set. Got a little weeping going on there on one side, but ain't the end of the world. Man, I think I'm probably wrapping pretty soon. We may do yet another spritz. Um, about the four hour mark, uh, but the color's looking pretty dope. And I uh, definitely don't want this little guy to dry out too much, so I don't want to get too far into the 160s or 170s. Um, probably one more spritz. Think about a wrap. You'll know when I know. Okay, we're more than four hours in the books here. I like the crust where it's at. We're just gonna put some foil on her. Probably wrapping is the next thing you're gonna see. Buster. Fresh from the smoker. It's our little mini butt. I better get down to business, gang. I'm gonna treat this like a rack of ribs. Treat it like we should, with my clean hand, dirty hand. You already know. Whoa. That should be plenty. There's that. And I'm just gonna add a little extra bit of the um, spritz there. We'll give this bottom side that got a lot of abuse, we'll give it a little bit of moisture. Time to get down to business here. This is how we're, uh, we're gonna finish this in that cooker. Put the probe in her and take her to 203. We are putting this bundle of joy into the party stacker. Just pulled it out 206 and it's already gone up 207. Uh, just for verification purposes. It's a, there's a chance it could go higher, but we'll see. And be back with you for the finale. All right. It looks like not too much leaked out on us, gang. For the record, court stenographer, I would like you to show that it reads 185 still. <laughs> well, there's our little, little bitty money muscle. We're gonna do some slices. Goodness gracious. I was worried some of the bark is coming off, but it's not. That is still one nice, tasty piece with a beautiful smoke ring. Favorite barbecue sauce. Mm -hmm. Money muscle me, please. Mm. Whole shot, bunch of sandwiches, seven bucks. All these. Money Muscle Sandwich. Cheers to y'all. Have a look at the tenderness. You give somebody this sandwich at a party, you got a buddy for life. One of the best budget barbecue meals you can get. Half pork butt, no bone, no fuss, no muss. I hope you enjoyed this cook. If you want more like it, hit that notification bell, click subscribe. You can join my tribe, jump in the backyard, hang with my gang, and get to cooking with us. Like a, if a crock pot could give smoke flavor. Mmm. 
Shout out McRib. You still my bitch. Did you see the size of the bag of charcoal? <laughs> Your algorithm can suck it, bro. I got that money muscle sando. Camera's still rolling, I'm still rolling. Microphone good, check one, two. We don't like no feedback. What's up? I can't believe both these bad boys are still going. They're both flashing dead deaders on me. Going to the land of the deadies. Fucking hammering hard, ain't he? Maybe his clubhouse will get put together soon.